I I should say I'm allergic to cats. Are you really? But I didn't think I was on the tier of people that you you come to them. Mm-hmm. That's like reserved for well, your they, judge. I don't your... I don't think that uh, <laughs> what's reserved for either very old people, right, or or very busy famous people. Exactly. No, I mean I'm I none would, of that. No, I would have come. I mean, yeah. <laughs> if it, if, but also I wanted to to do it like proper. No, I, I appreciate that. Yeah. I, I appreciate your respect for um, the for the ritual space that is a garage. Yeah, this is huge. How how allergic are you? I mean, like, I, well, I, I I have like uh, probably an hour before my um, system collapses. Not really. It's I'm gonna get itchy in the throat. That's it. Do you feel and it then, now? No, no, I'll be fine. Really, for I took a Claritin. Wow. Yeah. Do you have other allergies? Uh, no, it's like really just cats. And 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 your but your throat doesn't close up. It's not like a nut allergy. No, it just I get very itchy and my <laughs> nose starts running. It's unpleasant. <laughs> Fucking poor Helms couldn't breathe. Yeah, I remember that. And I kept pushing through. I know. I, he had it worse than I do. It was horrible. Poor guy was wheezing, and I just sort of like I haven't gotten what I need yet. I know. We're gonna no, keep plowing through here. I went to the store and I bought Claritin, and I always I get paranoid when I buy Claritin because I think that they think I'm using it for meth. Or is something. that a meth thing? I thought that was Sudafed. I, I don't I don't think Claritin is in the family. Well, of- I think Claritin D has the uh, ephedrine in it. Oh, I also it, it's funny that because do you have of, to sign for it? No. Well, I just got the regular Claritin, oh, okay. not, right. not the D. All right. All right. But uh, you get the, if you get the D, you get jacked up though. Get the little extra added. Yeah, exactly. The benefit. No, I'm more of a downers guy. I don't like uppers. No, no. We, uh, really? You just like to yeah. No, no blow. No. Uh, what no, happens I, to you? Do you become annoying? I had like one bad experience with blow <laughs> when I was in high school or like coming out of high school. That was it. Yeah, it was a really bad experience where I, you know, me and my friends just decided this is the night that we're going to do it. Yeah. We're going to go crazy and we're just going to do rails all night. Yeah, rails. And and um, it was also one of those nights where, like, I ended up liking people that I just would have never, like, even oh, yeah. the dealer that came over. Oh, sure. Who was like, can I get a, a, a serrated blade for this, cutting it up? And I was yeah. like, man, you really know what you're doing. That's yeah. really cool, man. <laughs> and... Uh, and then I went home at like seven a.m. I was I was living at my parents' house for the summer. Yeah, and uh, I thought I was dying. I, yeah. I was sure that I was dying. Oh, along with I, your heart pounding. I couldn't pounding. sleep, heart yeah. pounding, and I was like, "Oh, this is actually a drug that people do die from." Sure, I'm not, it, it's not in my head. People do overdose. Yeah, yeah. Went downstairs to my parents' bedroom. My dad's a doctor. Oh, I good, woke yeah. him up. Yeah, I said, "I'm gonna level with you." <laughs> I did a lot of blow. And I think I'm dying. And he was like, you're not fucking dying, man. Take a NyQuil. <laughs> and I think I just needed to hear it from a, an MD. Lock the gate! <laughs>